what it sounds to me is this yes, is really dear. about because what 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 it's really worked for me mm-hmm. is is detachment you're you're detaching from your like like matt and i talk a lot about attachment to outcome yeah that that causes a lot of anxiety your attachment to outcome like like you're saying like this has to be a certain way or i'm not good enough yeah. so so detaching from that it's, and it's it's so important, especially when you do want something a lot. Like those are the those are the times where that that matters, where detach and, detachment matters yeah. the most. I'm having a stroke. I don't know. I'm so excited <laughs> about this conversation. <laughs> but those because we are we're up for big stuff all the time. We're up for like television shows or a movie, and we have to go in there. I I know for a fact. You know, remember that Oprah thing? What I know for sure. Yeah. When I go in attached to I've got to get this mm-hmm. yeah it never goes well yep no. and yep. when I go in saying um uh, this is the other exercise of yours that I do um this is an anxiety relieving thing when I go into the room I look at something to to anchor myself in the room you like look at a picture at the wall or you I look or that. yeah you mm-hmm. notice something and just kind of acknowledge it and then the other thing is I give myself permission to hate them. <laughs> yeah, no, that's the thing I'd love to share today with your audience. It's so powerful. That that's, that uh, short circuits all anxiety. Yeah. Is the concept yeah. that you have permission to hate your audience or to hate the people around you as a healthy way to love them. Can because you say it, more about that? What yeah, that mean? yeah, Absolutely. because that was that was the tricky part for Our, me. I was like, how do I go in here? Am I going to come in with a negative vibe? And no, you won't. What that does is what that what I've learned is it. I'm not, I'm not concerned about what they're thinking. Yes, I, because the truth kind, is, yeah. you don't know what they're thinking, and mm-hmm. whether someone likes you or not has nothing to do with you. The the truth is we're worried about what we think about ourselves. So our vulture projects our own inner self hatred Mm -hmm. onto the people around us thinking, Oh, it's not me that thinks I'm a bad actor or a bad boyfriend. It's them. They Uh think I'm a bad actor, et cetera. And so when you give yourself permission to hate the person in front of you, then why would you care what they think of you? If you don't care what they think of you, it gets rid of that blank slate. You were projecting your fears onto and, Matthew's uh, not sold yet. He's kind of well, like I, he's I, processing it. I'm, I'm just he has, his, 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 his. I know him very well. His no, I'm just curious. So I'm just. I, I am curious. No, I, I do. I like love the concept. I'm tracking mm-hmm. with you. I'm just kind of. I have a question. My question yeah. is, does that have the potential? Right. Like if you go to the place of just kind of like you know what? No, I hate you. Does that have no. the potential to? I didn't infl- say you hate them. I want to oh. be very clear right now. Okay. I said, give yourself permission, permission to hate them. To... I will oh, never. Hate them. Why would you. I hate a human? We're all one. I love. I don't humans. know. I'm I'm so grateful so, for the clarification, uh, though. Yeah, yeah. So it's not that you're, <laughs> but you know, you're not supposed you go... to go in and set fire to the room. God, no, no. just it, permission. I, you just clear because, the space to hate them if you feel so compelled. I could if I wanted to, which makes <clears throat> right. me stop needing their approval because ah, I used to go into audition rooms okay. like, "Okay, hey, please like me, please like me." Yes. But now that I have permission to hate them, if I want wanted to I actually walk in smiling I'm I'm comfortable I'm I'm easy going because I don't need anything from them Ah. which is actually the elevated mature way to love your fellow man because needing things from people needing their approval is not a healthy way to love it's a childlike way and so um yeah, yeah. So, did that help clarify a little? That bit? That absolutely did. No, that was a really good distinction for me because I, because I, you know, I thought you were saying like you had to hate them, but you don't. You just have to clear the space. You have to give yourself permission to hate them, and then that also kind of absolves the need. Yeah, you know, it's like it's almost like that phrase when you go, ah, fuck them. Like if they, they yes. like me, they like me. If they don't, they uh, don't. Yeah, I do yeah. that a lot. Where I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. I, I see myself. I'm caught up in this. I want yeah. this outcome. I want this, you know, reaction. You know what? Fuck it. I don't care. And then I always do the best work. Yeah, exactly. Because the yeah. goal is to impress people. The goal is to do your best work and to get the job or get the boyfriend. But you have to play tricks with your brain to, to yeah. short circuit that vulture yeah. who's yeah. trying to ruin your life. 